but in trade, it's all gold surged again in Monday's session. Uh, despite that rise in US Treasury yields and setting a new closing high, there was little uh, fundamental news to drive the rally, though a comparable surge, I guess, in the crypto markets and seemingly given the other alternative currency a tailwind. Uh, this four up sessions in a row for gold with momentum really behind it, uh, eyeing that all time intraday high set back in December of 2049 US dollars an ounce. Though uh, XAU USD is trading at extreme overbought levels uh, on the RSI there. The US dollar was uh, modestly lower, the dollar index, I should say, modestly lower in Monday. Um, slow news day, no US economic releases. Uh, DXY trading between that 100 and 200 days simple moving average with a range around 103.72 to 103.96, so very tight. Uh, really, I guess the highlight was remarks from the Fed's boss, Dick, who pushed back somewhat on rate cut expectations, saying there was no urgency to cut rates given the US economy's strength. And uh, when rate cuts do start, they'll probably won't be back to back, though. This saw yields, uh, US Treasury yields rise slightly, but didn't help the US dollar much. Um, though the dollar did rally against the Japanese yen. Uh, with rising US Treasury yields uh, ahead of today's Tokyo CPI, similarly the main driver there. Though for yen watchers, Bank of Japan Governor Ueda is also due to speak later in the APAC session in Tokyo and uh, could cause some volatility in the yen crosses.